So let's see this problem. This is a, again a very interesting problem. Here the question says that 15 to the power x plus 15 to the power x plus 1 divided by 4 to the power y is equal to 15 to the power y. Then we need to find the value of x. Given information is also that x and y are integers. So let's try to simplify this. So it can be written as 15 to the power x plus 15 to the power x times 15 to the power n. 1 divided by 4 to the power y. Here we have to exponent ka property lagaya hai. Agar a to the power m plus n hai, so it can be written as a to the power m times a to the power n. So, ye wali property hume yaha pe lagai hai. So, this can be further written as 15 to the power x can be taken as common. So, here it will be 1 plus 15 to the power 1 that is 15 divided by 4 to the power y okay and this is equal to 15 to the power y that means 15 to the power x this will become 16 times 16 is equal to 15 to the power y times 4 to the power y. This will be then 15 to the power x. This 16 can be written as 4 to the power 2. Then here it will remain same. So 15 to the power x and this can be taken to the other side. 15 to the power y multiplied by 4 to the power y and divided by 4 to the power 2. So we can see again we can apply this particular property that a to the power m divided by a to the power n can be written as a to the power m minus n. So 15 to the power x will be 15 to the power y times 4 to the power y minus 2. That means and x and y are integers. It is given x and y are integers. So that means this whole term for this whole term to be equal to to this term we need to have this term 4 to the power y minus 2 as 1. Okay. So for this whole term to be 1, we need y minus 2 to be 0. y minus 2 to be 0. Why? Because integer, any integer, any number to the power, let's say m, will be 1 only when, only when m is equal to 0. That means this is 0. So therefore y minus 2, we want this to be 0. So that means y will be 2. So now this is very simple. So 15 to the power x is equal to 15 to the power y. y means 2 times 1. This 4 to the power 0 times 4 to the power 0 means it will be 1. So 1, that means x is equal to 2. This is our answer.